In this video, I'm going to quickly show you how to uh, change the basic appearance of the pencil tool. And this is one feature that uh, in Illustrator, it's always slightly bugged me, but uh, as a default mode for the pencil tool, I'm just going to select the pencil tool. You can find the pencil tool here and just apply it. And it's okay. I mean, nothing brilliant. It just basically draws the standard stroke and that's it. Now, what I really want it to do is actually use the width profile. So obviously it makes it a much nicer thing. Of course, there's an easy way of doing that. You can actually just go to the thing, just select that, just apply that. And I'm just going to increase the size so it's a bit more obvious. And of course, once I go back to the pencil tool, and I'm just going to quickly select it again, just apply it, it goes back to the default single line. No width profile. Quick easy way around that, and that's go to the window, appearance, and once you go over there, there is a option, new art has basic appearance. Turn that off. Now, why that isn't actually in the, uh, the pencil dialogue, or maybe in the preferences or something, or maybe even as a default, the other way, turn it off, it would be nice, but anyway, it isn't. And so new art has basically, I'm just gonna turn that off now, so when you go there, so I'm now going to apply the pencil tool and it actually takes the information from here so the stroke 20 points variable width etc and brush, brush definition so I'm just going to quickly select one of those so now I can apply the brushes and it's great that's exactly what I want anyway that's the not default mode in Illustrator and how to make uh, the Illustrator pencil tool far more useful in one quick click.